हेलो स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट दी बेसिक टेस्ट फॉर ड्रग्स अंडर दैट मेडिसिनल प्लान मटेरियल्स राइट सो एज वी नो वी हैव डिस्कस्ड इन द लास्ट क्लास दैट बेसिक टेस्ट फॉर ड्रग इट इज फॉर दी फार्मास्यूटिकल सब्सटेंसेस इट इज फॉर दी मेडिसिनल प्लान मटेरियल्स इट इज फॉर दी फार्मास्यूटिकल डोजेज फॉर्म राइट सो एज ए क्वालिटी कंट्रोल फार्मासिस्ट इफ एनी ड्रग इट विल सेलेक्टेड रैंडमली फ्रॉम दी मैन्युफैक्चरिंग यूनिट एंड इफ इट विल कम फॉर दी testing right or into the small laboratory where the well equipment it is not available it is not well equipped laboratory so in that case what kind of test it has been framed by the who so that the each and every lab will be able to test the drug for its identity its purity or its quality right so let's discuss about the basic test of drugs which is there in the standardization of herbal drugs right क्वालिटी कंट्रोल एंड स्टैंडाइजेशन ऑफ हर्बल ड्रग क्यू सी एस एच यूनिट वन दैट सेकेंड टॉपिक इट इज द बेसिक टेस्ट फॉर मेडिसिनल प्लान मटेरियल्स राइट सो इन दिस द टेस्ट प्रोसीजर फॉर मेडिसिनल प्लान मटेरियल्स वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस राइट सो देर आर फ्यू मेडिसिनल प्लान एग्जाम्पल इट हैज गिवन सो दैट वी विल बी एबल टू वाट आर द प्रिलिमिनरी टेस्टिंग इट हैज टू बी डन टू आइडेंटिफाई द पर्टिकुलर क्रूड ड्रग सो द फर्स्ट वन इट इज द epicac root right so epicac wana it is also known as epicac root whenever it will be come into the for the testing or it it is it has to be dried rhizomes it is dried root of cephalis epicac wana that is the botanical name of this particular root cephalis epicac wana which belongs to the rubiaceae family right so there are uh, three test has been given with the minimum chemical requirements so that the small laboratory also can be able to identify first of all that root drug powder we have to take the root powder we have to take and we have to add the uh, hydrochloric acid and after that uh, hydrogen peroxide we will add we are going to warm the particular solution the set up set up solution we are going to observe the orange color right that is the presence of rubrimating right so that is the one of the chemical constants which will be there in the epicac root so because of presence of this it is going to give you the orange color that will confirm the given sample of powdered root drug it is nothing but epicac root second test we can adopt uh, we can take the drug powder then ammonia and after adding the dichloromethane and uh, we have to shake it after shaking properly it has to be filtered properly then add water and acetic acid again you are going to get the orange color so that will confirm the presence of epic cake root or given sample of drug it is epic cake root powder then uh, in above filtrate whatever the filtration we have done after shaking in that filtrate if you add ethanol and uh, uh, deep the one filter paper and iodine vapor we have to expose that filter paper we are going to get the blue fluorescence at uh, 365 nm uv light right so in that uv light if you put that filter paper blue fluorescence it is going to appear right so that will also confirm the presence of epicac root right under this medicinal plants uh, uh, the test test for medicinal plant material we are having the second drug that is the podophyllo resin right that is a very important anti cancer drug that also you can write in your answer the first one this is the resin uh, from the root and rhizome we are getting of the plant podophyllum hexandrum right so there are series of test has been given first of all powder of the resin you have to take then you have to add the potassium hydroxide solution you are going to get the yellow color and uh, uh, if you stand it for the for few minutes uh, dark color it is going to appear and again in powder if you add ethanol and potassium hydroxide if you shake you are going to get the jelly right so jelly formation stiff jelly formation it is going to be observed again in third test you are going to take the powder add ethanol and ferric chloride right fecl3 if you add deep dark green color it you are going to observe in fourth test again with the powder it after adding ethanol add water and h2so4 and uh, you are going to cool it right after that orange to brownish red color it is going to be observed that will confirm the presence of podophyllo resin in the given sample of drug right now coming to the third drug that is called a senna leaf or senna fruit both it is being used for as a drug crude drug right so in the senna leaf the first of all the botanical name it is uh, cassia angustifolia belongs to the family leguminosae that also you can write down because that is the main identity of this particular 
when you are going to take that fruit right send a fruit uh, it is having slight order mucilaginous and uh, our sweet taste you are going to have and a slight bitter also it can be observed after that chemical test if you adopt for the fruit first of all fruit powder you have to take add hydrochloric acid warm it after warming you have to cool it after cooling add toluin and evaporate yellow color yellowish color you are going to observe and after that after observing yellowish color you have to filter it in that filtrate add ammonia and warm you are going to get the red violet color right so this is the one of the simplest test to identify the senna fruit second test you can adopt uh, after taking the senna fruit powder add hydrochloric acid uh, sorry uh, sulfuric acid h2so4 you are going to observe the greenish to brownish color right whereas leaf senna leaf is also very popular to use for it is very important purgative so in that case also we are going to get in the leaf order is going to be slight mucilaginous and sweet taste we are observing just like a fruit and slight bitter right so fruit and leaf the uh, main organoleptic characteristic it is going to be almost uh, similar when we talk about the chemical test uh, we are going to uh, take the powder and uh, we are going to take the ethanol right uh, we are going to add ethanol warm for 5 minutes then filter it add hcl and again heat it ethyl acetate uh, you are going to add after adding ethyl acetate shake it properly then separate ethyl acetate layer the two layer it is going to form ethyl acetate layer has to be uh, separated and the sodium hydrogen carbonate uh, you are going to add you are going to observe the reddish yellow color that will confirm the given sample of powder it is senna leaf powder only second test you can adopt uh, under powder you can add water and heat it one drop hcl after adding uh, one drop hcl and dichloromethane uh, discard the dichloromethane layer again two layer it is going to form in this case also so dichloromethane layer has to be separated and add a ferric chloride fcl3 and a 6 ml of water heat it properly shake properly then add potassium hydroxide red orange color it is going to be observed that will uh, indicate the presence of senna leaf powder right so uh, that's what a few very good examples has been given which is very popular medicinal plant material or drug which is uh, going to be there in the large scale production so what are the small laboratory can perform this test this has been given by the who guidelines thank you